Hey everybody. People talking in my back here. Anyways, I just thought I'd uh, do kind of a final walk around. It's kind of a sad day here at uh, Smoot Shack. For uh, the old 59 is leaving. Thought I would do a basically a one last walk around of the old truck um, as some of you remember I got a 65 Chevy uh, I traded the guy pretty much straight across that one for this one uh, the other one runs this one doesn't he wants this one he wanted to make the deal not me so couldn't really turn him down I'm gonna miss this old truck though. I've had it for a few years now. Tilt steering, power seat, needs a good home, a lot of TLC. So uh, yeah, but that's it. It's it's gone. I just finished pulling it out of its uh, resting place over there and getting it ready for them to come and hook onto it on the weekend. And yeah, final final video of the old truck well it's just going down the street so I probably get video of it when he gets it up and running or whatever but saying goodbye to the truck kind of sad gonna miss that old beast but but not really anyways I'll just take you back there and show you what I traded that truck for and on the way I thought I would kind of give you a, a quick view of the skidoos we've got back here. There's Smoot's newest one. I know you're going to give me shit for it being parked out here, but it was actually parked on the other side. I had to move it and I was just kind of sitting there. Got the 71 Merc, the XLT, the Yamaha, the black thing, Formula Z, the one who wears bras skidoo that she had when she was a kid. I gotta get that one running. Uh, the one my grandfather gave me. The one a buddy gave me. The one I bought. The one I found. The one I sold. Another one that was given to me. The one that's pretty much lunch was given to me. Bought this one. Bought that one bought one of these and the other two were well no, I guess I've actually paid for each one of them there's Scoot, Smoot's goal cart Scoot's mole part and yes people this is the truck that I traded the other truck for uh, this one runs it's got motor issues it's got body issues but whatever he wanted to make the deal I offered him cash and we had made a deal and he seen the uh, 59 so he was the one that come up with the idea. So, whatever. This truck is probably in worse shape than the other one, body-wise, because the floorboards are rotted out and the fenders are starting to go. But, but it makes them never mind. Getting rid of one for the other. So, anyways, I just thought I'd give you a quick walk around. Um, all them sleds that I just posted on there, if anybody in this area knows anybody that wants parts or anything off of them, just about all of them are for sale for parts or as a fixer, whatever. So anyways, I'll just give you a quick shot around here. Smoot's boat just parked her there a couple days ago. We were out fishing. The wood pile. And what's left of the garden. The garden's pretty much done now. We didn't get a lot. We kind of waited too long to plant. Smooth yard. It's a mess. But it is, but it's not. Because I'm actually in the process of cleaning it up. Though you wouldn't really believe it. It's just a lot of shit is, hasn't found its way to the scrap pile. Or to its new parking spot. So, But anyways, hope you guys all enjoyed that. It's, oh shit, it's only a five minute video. <laughs> wow awesome okay well I'll get this posted and uh, once I start working on this old 65 here uh, probably as soon as my days come off, days off come I'm going to uh, start ripping the motor top that motor down because it's got a bad valve and I think it's just a lifter 
and although the way it's smoking I think it might be a head like the head the valve guides fucked on it but I'll find out um, try to find out what size motor it is you can see it in the background <laughs> Find out what size motor it is, maybe I can get a reconditioned head for it, or maybe take this head in and get it fixed, because uh, I'm pretty sure the bottom end's still in good shape. I'd like to get it running, polish it up a little bit, and maybe, maybe even just throw it back on, on the Kijiji, try to get rid of it. Because I've got that one, and then up there, you can kind of see the front of it. I've got the old uh, Dodge Power Wagon, and then you kind of wander back in over here. And I've got the old swamp donkey. And uh, basically I'm just looking to liquidate some of this shit. Just get it out of my life. Get my yard back. Um, we're actually thinking maybe here uh, of uh, selling one of these properties kind of to help pay, you know, pay off one. Pay, well, sell one and I'll pay off the other one, right? I won't, I'll be mortgage free. But... Really, quite honestly, I've accumulated just way too much junk and I, it's time to get rid of it. So that's what I'm going to work on here for the next month or so. Try to liquidate some of these skidoos and then, you know, just go from there. But anyways, I just thought I would uh, bring you out here, take you for a walk around and then I just rambled on for two minutes. So, But you know me, that's the way I wear all. Blah, 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 blah. Can't even talk. But anyways, okay, I'm going to go post this and I'll see you guys all later. I love you, bye, smooth out.